shift markers a squared plus b squared. This lesson is going to be about the law of signs, which is also known as the sign rule. Factorising non-monic trinomials using the cross method. So let's go over trigonometric functions and the number plane. So looking at two-thirds and four-fifths, we need to find the least common multiple of the denominators, which would be three and five. Factorizing trinomials where the leading coefficient is not a one is more complicated than what we saw in the previous exercise. Then what we're doing is we're going to complete the square just like we were doing last lesson. Hi, and welcome to our lesson on multiplying terms containing indices. The dog ate my homework. A certain teacher, Mr. Lie Detector, claims he can tell when students are lying about their homework. In this video, we're going to talk about different sets of numbers, and each of these sets has a particular name, vocabulary word. 